Hello guys, Imano from Geekception here and today I'm going to be doing the comparison between the Asus Zenfone 2 Laser and the Alcatel Flash 2. Now this comparison is an opinion based comparison which means you're not going to be seeing any benchmarks, only practical comparisons. Let's begin. <music> And welcome back guys now if you are new to this channel i've actually done individual 5d reviews for both phones so you can go check it out link will be in the description below starting off with the tour of the device the asus zenfone 2 laser runs android 5.0.2 lollipop while the alcatel flash 2 runs android 5.1 the ui running on the zenfone 2 laser is called zen ui customized by asus while the ui on the alcatel flash 2 is basically stock Android. And picking between both of them, having used both devices, I would say there's not a lot of lag uh, in both of them. Both of them run really, really smooth. And taking a tour around the devices, on the Asus Zenfone 2 Laser, it has got a 5.5 inch display, while on the Alcatel Flash 2, it has got a 5 inch display. Both at HD resolution or 720p, as some like to call it. Going on to the back of the devices, on the Zenfone 2 Laser, there's actually that uh, matte feeling back, which feels really nice, as opposed to on the Alcatel Flash 2, which has this sandstone back uh, texture feeling, which also feels pretty nice. But when it comes to the display, I would say on the Zenfone 2 Laser, it actually looks better, most probably because of the one glass solution that Asus has used on the display, for the Zenfone 2 laser. So for display, easily the Zenfone 2 laser wins. Talking about audio, I ran an audio test. Why don't you guys listen to it? And coming from that test, the Alcatel Flash 2 beats the Asus Zenfone 2 laser hands down, like, you know, no contest there at all. So when it comes to media, I would say for display, the Asus Zenfone 2 laser is good. For audio, I mean the speakers, the Alcatel Flash 2 is better. And talking about the camera of both devices, I ran certain tests, so check them out. And this is a front camera test of both cameras. I'm going to be testing both of them simultaneously. And then I'm going to be switching to them right now so that you guys can actually see the quality of both cameras. And that's basically it for the front camera test of both phones. And this is a back camera test of both phones. Now let me see if I can focus there, the autofocus. Yes, and uh, you guys can actually uh, judge for yourself which camera is better. Let me try to focus here as well. Uh, yeah. So I think now the Alcatel Flash 2 is focused. Not too much for the issues then from 2 laser. But you guys can kind of see the quality of the camera and how the camera actually is. Comparing the photos taken by both devices side by side, I would say it's pretty difficult actually because both devices have very good cameras and sometimes one takes a better picture than the other. But in a general scale, I would say both have a good dynamic range. If I were to choose one over the other, I'll choose the camera on the Asus Zenfone 2 laser, but hey, I don't know guys, let me know in the comments which one you think is better. And moving on to performance, the Alcatel Flash 2 beats the Asus Zenfone 2 laser, like um, opening up, up side by side, you can see uh, that extra 1 to 2 seconds that uh, loads faster on the Alcatel Flash 2 as opposed to the Asus Zenfone 2. So performance wise, I'll give it to the Alcatel Flash 2. Gaming on both devices were okay, um, I would say much much better and pleasant experience on the Alcatel Flash 2 because it's a bit more powerful than the Asus Zenfone 2 laser and on the Asus Zenfone 2 laser play more intensive games tend to make the phone lag. Moving on to battery life, uh, battery life on both devices were actually pretty good. They've both got 3000 mAh batteries and uh, throughout all the time I actually reviewed both devices. I had no problems with battery life so I give them a type when it comes to battery life. When it comes to differentiation, the Asus Zenfone 2 laser has that laser autofocus which assists the camera. It also has the back button, so instead of having the buttons on the sides, they're actually on the back. As opposed to the Alcatel Flash 2 that has uh, that dedicated camera button, which is actually the only special thing about the device, I would say. And another thing that differentiates both devices is actually price. For the Asus Zenfone 2 laser, it costs about $189, as opposed to the $132 that the Alcatel Flash 2 costs. Moving on to similarities, both devices have a double tap to wake, so when the screen is off, 
you can actually double tap the screen to wake it up and they also share similar awesome battery life like seriously guys all the time i use this phone i never got bored of them to die on me in a day and that has been it for this video guys i hope you guys have enjoyed this uh, uh, comparison video if you have give this video a big fat thumbs up uh, if you have not enjoyed anything in this video thumbs down and don't forget to subscribe as i said in the beginning of this video i've actually done individual five day reviews for both these devices so go check them out links will be in the description below anyways that has been it for this video guys i shall catch you guys in the next one don't forget to be awesome bye